Hello and welcome back to the channel today. I'm really excited because we're doing episode two of the hardcore series. We may be in a little different of a location than the last one. And I will be honest, I kind of messed up about seven minutes of recording. You didn't miss much and I'm kind of glad it did because I'm showing you right now our new home. That's right. This will house absolutely everything. And I'll show you why. Uh, while loading in uh, or walking over here, I kind of noticed... Oops. We can't forget this bed here. I kind of noticed a few different things. We have a really cool concave over here, which I want to turn into a farm. Let me show you real quick. Right here. Uh, I just think it's a really cool just water pool area that we could show all the crops around here and really just grow the, the vegetation around. We also have this entire open area with woods, with four, or a winter biome, a snow biome, whatever you want to call that and the vastness of caves and everything else that way. But imagine a home just right here on the water. That's what I'm talking about. Anyways, I'm so glad you decided to click on this video and join along on this journey with me. If you're new to the channel, welcome. And if you're not and you're returning, you absolutely are a legend. I just wanna say YouTube CEO called me recently. He was like, hey, Cloud, I have some, some good news and bad news. Which one do you wanna hear first? As the good human I am, I wanted to hear the bad news. And he told me that only 78% of you are not subscribed. Only, I guess that wouldn't be a word added into this. 78% of you are not subscribed. And I don't, you know, I, I get it. I, I'm here for it. And I'm so glad you're enjoying the videos. But I'm trying to make it 77 or 76%. And you have the power to do that. So, you know, if you feel so enticed, leave a like, leave a sub. It really helps a small channel out like myself. We're just going to start setting up our home base around here. Really get it going. Uh, because for me, I need to feel comfortable. Please accept your fate. Thank you very much. I want to start feeling more comfortable in this world. And I, I can't lie. Um, you know, my shield can only go so far. We need armor. We need a house. We really need to get this the basic necessities covered. And if we can do that, I think we'll be off to the races and everything else. So... We could start clearing some of these trees when we want to build a house, but right now, iron is the name of the game. So we'll set up our furnace, we'll set up our crafting table, and our first ever chest, just to get things cleared out of our inventory, right? We, we don't want to get too crowded, we don't want to get too comfortable, the name of the game, you know? So right away, we're going to start putting some of these, this iron right here, and we can actually get some items going. I think we should probably try to get a chest plate or helmet, boots, and pants. I don't know how much we'll be able to make with this, but we will have uh, one, two, three, 15, which, which is a solid amount. You know, you can't lie there. You're going to put emeralds in here, and we're just going to make up all of our food real quick because very important that we eat. So we will have enough food right here to last us quite a long time thanks to the um, the village that we pillaged earlier. It was legal. Kind of. Not really. Um, but we have made up all of the bread that we needed for quite a long time. We have some porked chicken or porked chicken. Cooked chicken. <laughs> cooked pork chop. A whole lot of bread. And we'll be good to go. I don't like that bread doesn't have a huge saturation. So I would like to also cook up this raw pork chop just for the mines. So we just feel extra, extra safe while walking through those. I can't imagine if we have a little bit of iron stuff as well as the shield. Uh, we'll be struggling too, too much. But, you know, we'll, we'll get it going. Look at this landscape. Maybe we go into like, the. Uh, maybe that's a cave. I don't know. Uh, but definitely we're, we're going to find our caving system and get it going in this episode no matter what we gotta feel safer because right now i feel like a wandering pig okay we're gonna put seeds away sugarcane away bamboo we picked up a lot of plants so we can really start this series off the right way and we'll actually put these in this chest here uh we're gonna make a whole bunch of Sticks. 
with torches and normally I, I will be honest normally I don't do this I actually save a lot of a lot of resources how do we get this oak slab did I just mess up um but being hardcore I really don't want to miss uh, like just risk anything at this point so we're going to make as many torches as we need um and really just set ourselves up for success while going into the mines so we have that we'll put some dye right away we need some some wood real quick so while that's smelting we'll just get some some standard wood some good old stuff for the mines just so whenever we need to make uh anything down there we can Jeez, that was a hard tree to get to. All right. Good to go. We have four, which means we have 17. I think that should be pretty good, if I'd say so myself. And I'm so glad that there's no drowned in this lake that we need to worry about. And there's a dolphin in this seclusion here. Are you kidding me? Does that open up that way? Let's see. Did we just get really lucky with the dolphin spawn here? Oh my gosh. This might be the best location we've ever set up. Granted, this is the only location we've ever set up, but I digress. Okay, so that would do eight. So we would have one left over. If we did this and a helmet, we would have two left over. So we could do this, this. Oh, man. I feel like a chest plate would probably be the best option with legs yeah yeah we're doing good here all right so we will bring the bed we need to remember that going under underground is is going to be quite the event here so we're gonna just cook this up and get it moving let's just go find where we're actually going to drop in hello dolphins and there's two how beautiful uh let's go find our cave system. I think I saw something. And horses? This is the best location I've ever seen in my life. Okay, hold on. Have we found a little cave system here? We have not. But it's good to light up this stuff anyways. And I actually don't want to lose where we were before. So I'm just going to place a few torches along the way back. I really don't want to risk anything in this series. It could go really bad. And really quick. Oh my gosh, the dolphins are just jumping around. How cool. All right, follow the torches. We must keep moving. We must. One day, you and I will become friends. Until then, we're going to keep killing cows and traversing the world on our own. It's a very sad world to live in. Living alone like that. I thought I saw an opening over here for a cave. I could be entirely wrong. Oh, would you look at that? I was correct. Okay. All right. We need to be somewhat smart about this. There could be quite a few things in here. Oh, speaking of. Oh my gosh. I'm not stressing. You're stressing. Come on. All right. We need to eat up now. I'm stressing. Okay. Just two mobs took us down half heart. I'm not too happy about that. Hello, creepers. How are you? All right, let's get it done. Let's get it done. How's it going? I don't need you right now, so I don't need to kill you. I just need enough space to just get the, this iron going. I'm going to just clear out the rest of this area down here. Okay, cool. So no more spawns. It should happen. I still want to stay somewhat careful. We do have our audio turned up quite a little bit just to make sure we can hear everything, but um, I'm nervous, you know, something could go wrong at any point and it could be right now. It could be in the future, but my only goal is to just become safer. We definitely need this, uh, this coal here. Oh, we could have died from that. Do you see that? Like that. All right, I'm going to leave that pocket there. Uh, let's see. We have three iron here, maybe? Maybe a little more? Come on. All right, three will do. At least we know we can remake our pickaxe at any point. And then I think natural... Oh, geez. I almost just 
Just took it. All right. Beautiful. Perfect. So we have 31 coal now. We could probably explore the other side of that cave system here. Let's check on out. What's going on in here? Hello? Hello? Oh, this is massive. What? Got a little hot spring. Now, this is one of the coolest cave systems I've ever seen. I can't lie. Alright, I do have a texture pack that has these ores very visible. Is it cheating? I don't know. Do I care? No. To be honest. It's already hardcore. I don't want to hear a thing. But it is complimentary shaders if you guys are interested. I do have it turned down a little bit as far as uh, shadows go because I do just not want to lag at all. I feel like that's that's a very... Hold on. Hey, hey, hey. We don't need to do that. I was talking. You don't need to do that right now. It was just rude, man. Um, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. This is not a good place to be. This is actually the place. Whoa! Oh my. Did we just strike gold here? We're just going to run around, place torches. I just want to get a lay of the land here. Wow, that already has stuff going on. Alright, we're going to be fine. We're going to be fine. I'm not stressing. You are stressing. Come on now, there we go. Alright, hey, we're doing pretty good. I, I was nervous before this because I've never really done well in the PvE aspects of this game. I just, it's not my strength. And so I was kind of nervous walking into this hardcore series. Like I have been. Uh, because at any point, I could just become complacent. And uh, we all know what happens at that point. So, I'm just going to light up this area down here. So much coal, so much iron. There's an enderman over there. We're not going to talk about it. I really don't. Look, like if he comes over here, maybe we could strike a deal. A deal with the devil over here just saying, Hey, look, listen. I didn't mean to step into your domain. I just need some resources. And you could help me with that. And then he, he responds back with a little growl. And uh, we run away. That's pretty much how I see this entire series going. Until we have diamond armor and everything else. Um, Let's see. Alright, there was some iron up here. Let's place another torch just to stop spawns. And if I didn't see this guy, he could have been pretty bad for us. Alright. Perfect. I'm so glad we get to clear these caves. Normally, like, you know, people are like, oh, whatever. Like, it's just, we, we don't need to light this up or anything. But me? I want to light every inch of this entire cave up. Just so I know nothing can spawn. Because when I know that can happen, where things can spawn, I get really nervous. And I'm going to cry. See, like, even right now, I'm stressing. But this is an insane cave biome. Alright. So, coal can never be too, too much, right? We, we gotta collect it all while it's here. I know, riveting gameplay. Riveting gameplay. Now, what is back here? Hello. Um, but we gotta do it. It's part of the name of the game, and it's it's the beautiful aspects of it. Help you have your, your popcorn. Help you have um, the things that make you happy. Hello. I'm so glad I have this shield. I actually think we'd be dead right now if we didn't have a shield. I, I just will be honest with you. So that first step... Oh, hey, 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 hey. Oh, I hate baby zombies. Okay. Wow. There's quite a lot to explore through here. I don't see any exposed diamonds yet. That's okay. You know, we don't need it right yet. I mean, we kind of do, but I'm going to act like we're okay. 
<laughs> I feel like I'm wasting a ton of torches here, but it's it's keeping me less stressed, okay? Keeping me a little less stressed. We're going to just make some more torches. Oh, we got to be careful with those sounds. Did Lapis just blow up? We got some Lapis. Look at that. All right. We'll come this way. Because I know we stopped to go the other way. All right. I don't want to mess with these. There's three of them. This is quite a lot. We can have them fight each other, though. Yeah, there you go. There you go. We don't need to be doing that. Look at that. See? Using our brains. Is there some emerald right there? Did I see that right? I'm still going to light up the whole area. I did see that creeper down there. Don't, don't let me fool you. Okay, I saw some enderman eyes over there. We're going to eat up. We are eating up quick. And I'm going to just make sure we're topped off. And our first emerald. Look at that. I guess we had some others from the other area. But it's the first mined emerald. I feel like we could celebrate that. Okay. Let's check out over here. Okay, so it does open up over here. That is great. Great news for us. Oh gosh, I'm getting nervous over here. All right. I'm just going to light up all of this. Whoa. This is really... Okay, so look. We are just we just came right across there. All right. We're going to light up this whole area. I don't care. It could be a waste of resources. But in hardcore, you can never be too, too safe. You know what I'm saying? Oh, look at this little strafe method we got going on. Getting double the distance over here. Yeah, look at how safe this looks. Are you kidding me? You couldn't ask for a more safe area. Actually, I could. Above surface. All right. And we're going to just make more torches. Coal will be pivotal. It's just the reality of this right now. Okay. Uh, we have not explored that, and we don't intend to. Oh, but would you look at this? Another emerald. That's kind of crazy. I can't lie with you. We're going to get some more of this coal here, because we've been using up quite a bit with torches. I feel like we need to get some type of either A, like a ton of coal for this entire series, or... We find a way to, uh, you know, get some charcoal going, get a farm for trees, some super smelters going, you know, the, the whole deal. The whole deal. We did pass some iron coming into this cave, so we'll make sure we go grab that. All right. Beautiful. Is that just water? Oh, no. I'm tripping. I'm tripping. Could ever be too, too careful here. Some nice ASMR coal mining. Predict what level I'm going to be by the end of this series. I'm going to say 2000. That's just my guess. I don't even know if there's a max level or not, but I'm aiming for it. That's my goal. That's what I live for. That's what I breathe for. And if you, if anybody comes in my way of accomplishing that goal, I will fight them. I didn't make the rules. All right. Let's keep moving here. So we actually haven't really gotten too much iron yet. We've been focusing a lot on coal. So I'm just going to really hone in on some of the iron pockets around here. Make sure that we're getting some. Is this a four vein? Let's see. Four. Not bad. So we have 10 total. We can actually make a full set of iron armor. Fantastic. And then right after that... Oh, hey. 
All right. All right. Need to be a little more careful there. Where do we get this extra thing of wheat? Has that always been there? All right. Look at this. More coal. Aren't you guys so happy? All this coal mining brings me back to my childhood of mining all the coal. Coal mining. Yeah, there is a ton of coal. I think we, we could probably be okay on coal right now. So. Hey, look at that. Not bad. Not bad at all. I guess we could start collecting gunpowder for the elytra later on. Um, have heard good things about that. Alright, come this way a little bit. And we'll just run off. We'll do it again. Ooh! We're fresh with it. We are fresh with it. Alright, what's up here? Nothing. Good to know. Alright, what a beautiful sight to see. Kind of nervous about this section here. <laughs> but what a beautiful sight. Do you see this? This is... This is revolutionary for this series right here. The pocket of the cave that we will be staying in for quite a long time. Maybe we'll actually transform this cave into something amazing one day. Uh, but baby steps. We need to first focus on our health before we focus on fun. And I need to keep reminding myself of that as we continue going deeper through this cave. You know, you know, since we have full iron... I don't really, I don't feel like it. I don't. We missed some iron over here. I just realized. I'm sure you guys are screaming in the comments. As usual, about how I miss little things here and there. But it's okay. You and I, we're in this together. And I appreciate those comments because I go back and I grab everything I miss. It's just the motion of the ocean, if you will. It is a lay of the land. You know, YouTube is really interesting as I've done this. I've actually done 115. This will be my 115th uh, daily upload in a row consecutively. And the, sir, uh, the, uh, the, man, the channel, that's the word. I was going to say server. The channel has seen just so much growth since then. I think we're about to hit 3,000 subscribers probably within the next few weeks or so. And I have to say, I've learned quite a lot from this experience of doing daily videos. Uh, one of those is that you guys have made this entire experience so much better than it would have ever been if I was doing it alone. So from the bottom of my heart, I just say with so much gratitude, thank you for joining along in this journey with me. You've made it significantly better than if I were to just be doing it alone. So kudos. Kudos to both of us. You know what I'm saying? I feel like feel like it, it takes two to tango, you know? And uh, we sure are tangoing. We're doing all the tangos. There we go. Feeling a little safer up here. Can't get too complacent. Gonna hold shift. All right. Was that worth three? <laughs> I don't know. But we are gonna pick up this cobblestone again uh, that we left up here. And actually, stuff could spawn right here. So I'm going to... Light it up. Perfect. Oh, gosh. All right. Don't you guys love that I just left that hanging there? I feel like it's a testament to our series. Every time we pass it, we'll say, wow, what a time to be alive. We were here for the second episode of Cloud's Hardcore Minecraft series. Amazing. Amazing news. I will say this is kind of like the series for me. You know what I'm saying? Like... We have the, the Terraria series going. We have some Minecraft videos going with Blake. But I've always, always, always wanted to do a Minecraft series. Even since I was in, I think, probably middle school, if not high school. And at this point I, in my life, I was just like, you know, I got to do this thing. I got to do it for real. And so we're doing it for real. Um, 
and it's scary. It's it it is. It has a lot of pros and a lot of cons, and not too many cons. So I'm just enjoying my life here. Let's get out of this cave. I can't lie. I I can't seem but feel like um it's time to go get fully kitted up with iron. Uh, did we miss any here? No. Okay. Let's build up here, though. Next to the good old water source here. Thank you for letting me up here. Alright, perfect. And I believe, if I'm correct... Yep, here's the torch. Perfect. Okay, so we're going to go back to the base. So glad we left the torches here. And, um... We'll be good to go. We'll take a little shortcut down here. Look at this. That's not shortcut at all. Okay. How much... Okay, we should have enough iron even to make another pickaxe. So, that's good. We need to make sure that we're saving at least one iron for the shield at all times. That is a necessity. And uh, we'll be good to go. I think maybe we could probably start after that, getting just some crops or uh, like chickens and things like that going. Probably before a house, because we need to remember we can always sleep, but we can't always um, live. You know, we, we need food. We are doing really well on food, though. I will say that much. 14 iron looking fantastic. Let's get a few more... Let's see, a few more trees cut down. We really don't want to worry about trees as a resource anytime soon. So we'll just get like maybe a little less than a stack right now of logs. Just so we have the abundance. You know, we're going to get a lot less than a stack. I will be honest with you. The laziness kicking in. Did we just stay up the entire night? Let's see what day it is. Day. Oh, gosh. How do I read this? Hold on, I'll find it. I'll find it. Day, there's a whole lot of stuff going on here. <laughs> well, you guys see my entire uh, PC setup. You, you see it all. Um, You know, it's day whatever it wants to be. That's really what it is. I'm sure you guys saw it because you're veterans and I'm clearly not. Um, but what is important is that we are still alive. I can't believe we are still alive through episode two. I will be honest. I didn't even think we'd be able to make it through night one or, or the first episode. So just to be this far along and this lucky with the series, like the RNG has been crazy early on. We got some ships. We got a great spawn for the, what's it called? Um, village. And now we have this abundant biome or biomes plural with everything else in between that's what traveling is about i didn't even see the pumpkins here and this giant cave system what hold on you're telling me this was right behind the house at all times you know i don't know who you are you are a zombie i don't want to deal with you right now oh my gosh why do I feel like skulk, the skulk biome is in here? Probably not, but... Alright, that will also be something we explore. And another pool. This is such a cool biome. I feel like we just got really lucky. We got really lucky. Alright. So we also have some chickens around here. Nothing to be scared of. We are definitely going to light up this entire area. I don't want to hear a thing. I just don't want to deal with spawns at night. If we do end up staying up a little after bedtime. So, that's what we're going to do. Just light up the city. We'll light up the city. Oh, how majestic. Oh, this would be really cool to build something in. Like, maybe a... Uh, a resource hut, or... We'll have to think about that. Because I love the natural stuff like that. Really riveting. For 
building and everything else. My end goal with this hardcore series is to just build some really cool stuff. I feel like we don't do that enough. At least I never did do that enough. Um, so. Oh gosh, it's getting nighttime. Let me go to sleep. Let me go to sleep. I'm nervy. I can't lie. It <laughs> just plays him everywhere. <laughs> I don't want to mess with it. I might even double up at some point, but that should be good for now, right? It should be. If it's not, we'll find out very quickly, you know? What is this? All right, let's go to bed real quick. We don't want to mess with it. We don't want to mess with it. And I believe for the first time, <clears throat> we have just found enough iron to get us fully kitted. Would you look at this? We have boots, we have a hat, and we have a pickaxe. We need to remember our iron axe is going to be dying soon. So we need to keep that in mind. But at least we have some more where that came from let's get this going i might just add a, a mod for quick stacking stuff in large chests that's something while playing terraria i really really grew accustomed to and learned to appreciate but i can also appreciate you know this as well this style so we'll see leather goes in this one beautiful Coal stacking in this one. We always hold coal on us. We don't need apple. We can put the apples in here. Let's build the rest of this wheat. I didn't even realize we had this until we were in the cave. Um, perfect. And uh, look at that. We could even plant this tree right here. How beautiful. Okay. Um. We have enough of a whole lot. I'm going to just throw this pickaxe out. Get, in, get on out of here, boy. Um, Look at that. We are fully kitted up for the first time in this entire series. I'm feeling so good now. Oh my gosh. Episode 2. We've already achieved so much. I'm going to take a sip of coffee real quick. Ah. I'm a black coffee drinker. Really terrible. Actually, it tastes amazing to me. Unless it's a bad roast, and this one, I'm starting to feel that way. Oh, look at the baby fish. How cute. Wow, I'm feeling so good about this series. Like, this is, this is something that, I, like, from the bottom of my heart, I mean this genuinely. Something I've always wanted to do. And something always held me back, whether it was fear, whether it was anxiety about what other people thought about me, whether it was, um, I mean, time, money, resources, everything else. I said, screw it. We're just going to do it. We are just going to do it. And so here's your sign. If you have a goal, a dream of yours that you want to do, just do it. Don't wait for the right time because it will never be the perfect time. You know, it will never be the perfect time. Oh my gosh, we are lit. We are lighting this place up. We definitely want to light this area up as well. Don't want to mess with any spawns at night. Honestly, we're doing really good. Just need to keep on going. Now, I was thinking of doing some live streams of this game. Um, let me know in the comments what time... If you guys would even like to watch a live stream, what time works best for you? I'm also going to do a poll in the Discord, so definitely hop on in there if you haven't yet. Because, I don't know, I feel like hardcore series are great online, uh, on YouTube, you know, but some of the tedious stuff like gathering coal and, you know, getting all the materials for a giant build is not always the best for content's sake, 
You know what I mean? So let me know. It would it would mean a lot. If you guys even want to see that, right? I feel like it'd be kind of cool to start, but Is there any coal? Any iron? We're definitely going to go in here. Probably the next episode or so. Um, but man, we are good. All right, so let's get a chicken farm going. Or a horse, or a cow, or whatever it is we want to get going. I think that would probably be the smartest thing to do right now. As well as start our other farms. We don't have enough iron for a bucket. And I didn't think about that one yet. So I guess we could just start our farm down in that area over there. I think that's a future build. Right now, we'll probably be... This will be everything for us. So we'll build a little hut here. We'll build a whole chicken area over here. Maybe that's what that is. Uh, maybe that's like the staple that the stable that holds all of the the materials and resources, like the chest. And then we'll build the different, you know, farms around here, whether it be the cow farm, the chicken farm, the sheep farm, inside of this kind of enclave here. Speaking of chicken. Would you look at that? All right, so let's go make some fences and we'll just make a standard, a very standard, um, oh, wow. Okay, hold on. Do I even know what I'm doing? Fence. Perfect. And now we will do... So we have 18 fences out of that, and then we just need an oak gate here. I guess we could probably double up on the gate, but right now this will do fantastic. And we will make it, I, I think it needs to be out in the open right now. I don't want to see anything falling down here onto them, you know? The stuff you don't think about in survival really does matter here. Um, I guess we should be good if we just light up this area but you never be too careful so we'll do it closer to right here i think that's probably the best bet oh actually i really like this area let's do it right here perfect All right, and then now let's get our fences going. A beautiful first chicken base. Would you look at that? We could expand it a little bit more. I believe one, two. Oh no, we're one short. We're one short. What are we doing? Um. <laughs> I'll just make another crafting table. It's okay. That's how we, uh, that's how we roll, you know? Now we have three more fences. Man, all right. So we have three seeds. Let's go get this chicken. Hello. Come on over here, boy. Come on in. This is your new home. Come to this back corner. Thank you very much. You try to escape. You're done for. Telling you that right now. We don't need to mess with it. I will fight to the death. Oh my gosh. So many eggs. What are the odds? We get a lucky spawn here. No. Alright, where's another chicken? Help me find another chicken. Oh, would you look at that? Hey, bud. Oh my gosh, and more. We could probably get these up here. Because it'll just be a little quicker for us to get our farm going. Can we try to pick this one up along the way? Honestly, we're probably good. But, you know, farms grow exponentially, right? So if we just get a little extra one here or there. Let me eat. I'm sorry. It's getting nighttime. I'm nervous. Come on, guys. We're coming back to the base. There you go. You look great. You know that? Little chicken one, chicken two. I'm going to call you 
Um, maybe I start naming chickens based on who's in the Discord. <laughs> you're Fizz Pop. <laughs> and you're JD. There we go. And hop in the Discord if you want to be a chicken. <laughs> All right, let's get on in here. Mate, thank you very much. Let's see the baby chicken. Let's go. And we have our first farm set up for the long term here. I'm feeling really good about this. So we'll continue going up a little bit here. Let's see. Beautiful. Yeah, I just want to honestly light up all of this. I know it's probably so bad. It looks so bad. But for me, this is just a safety measure. We can always change it later on. Hide some of the torches, some of the lighting stuff. But right now, I can't mess with it. I just can't. This is too good of a seed to lose. And so I'm probably going to back up this world even shortly. I don't know what seed it is. It was just a random one. I believe. Could be wrong. Could have just put in something stupid. Like I would normally do. Wow. All right. So we haven't explored this yet. There's so much to explore in this game. All right. Well, I think we're at a good place. We got crops going. We got our full set of iron armor. And this is seeming like it's a series for the long term. If you've enjoyed the video so far or in general, I just want to say thank you so much for joining along. Hit subscribe, hit like. Comment some suggestions below as what I should transform all of this area into. You guys are about to see a monster of a builder. I, I don't even know if I'm good at building. We're going to find out very soon. But I just want to say thanks for joining along. And I'll see you. Uh oh, hold on. And I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.